guys welcome back to another vlog i am going i'm running in to go get my hair cut um i go to john arago she's on newberry street in boston and she's literally the best i will never go to see anybody else for my hair i will never let anyone else touch my hair like she's so so good but i'm just gonna get a little trim and freshen it up today is thursday november 18th and my birthday's on Sunday, so I'm like doing a lot today and tomorrow to get ready for my birthday. I'm going away on a little surprise trip to St. Pete Beach. And also, if you have been there before and have any recommendations, please leave a comment down below and let me know like what your favorite restaurants are, like things to do in that area because I have never been and I'm really excited. So yeah, but I'm gonna go run in and get my hair cleaned up because it needs it. I haven't gotten a trim in like two months. So I'll show you guys a little before. This is what it looks like. Also, random, but it's 66 degrees today. Like it's really hot out and it's the middle of November. It's literally crazy, it's so hot out. I was so surprised when I woke up this morning. Hair is done, it looks so good. Like I'm obsessed with it. It just feels so light and she cut the pieces around my face a little bit so yeah i'm really happy with the way that it looks also i had a nail appointment and my hair ended up going like longer than expected so i missed my nail appointment <laughs> i need to get new gel also you guys know i shut my finger in my car door and like my nails falling off <laughs> dinner um i'm going out with emma and graydon tonight and i just want to show you my outfit before i go they're literally waiting for me in the car right now so i need to hurry but i'm wearing this oversized flannel from revolve little white crop t-shirt some levi's and then i have on these ugg uh, like platform slip-on shoes <laughs> i think we're celebrating my birthday early since I'm not gonna be here, but I'm really excited. Okay, love you guys, bye. Good morning. Good morning. It's our birthday weekend. Yeah, it is. Like, and I have go. the same birthday. <laughs> I just wanted to tell the vlog that. <laughs> but we're gonna get started with our workout. <laughs> obviously out of our workout and I got a orange juice from Greystone. They have Natalie's which is one of my other favorites. You guys know I love Uncle Matt's but I also love the Natalie's so whenever a place has this like I always get it. Um, and then I got an iced coffee with almond milk. You know just like I already had a coffee before the workout but I was like you know what maybe I'll have like a little bit more um and uh also i need lip balm like really bad i'm getting my i'm getting a spray tan in a little while so gotta go home and prep you know what i got the other day a burnt bees at Woods. yeah so they don't that. really yeah I was like, wait, I kind of want that. 
I just got back from my spray tan a little bit ago. Guys, it looks so good and it's so natural. I tried a different solution than I normally do. I go to Spencer. I've literally been going to her for like two years now and she's so good. She's the only person I trust doing my spray tans and she had a different solution this time and she was like do you want to try it because i have like really fair skin and she found that the solution she used on me this time just like works a lot better on fair skin because emma has more olive toned skin and the one that we used to get well that i used to get it was more like had a red undertone and this one's more like chocolatey brown so she said it's gonna look like less orange which i've already noticed like it looks so much more natural than the one that i've gotten in the past and I'm so happy with the way that it looks like it just like looks so natural and like bronzed and sunkissed And I'm really happy with it. Like it doesn't feel as sticky either That's one thing that she was talking about like the base of the spray tan how this one's more of like a dry oil base And the other one was aloe which meant it was like a little bit more tacky and this one just feels like a lot more comfortable, but I'm literally wearing my like spray tan outfit literally every time i get one i wear this little gray set just because i don't want spray tan to get all over my clothes and i just want to set up the camera and show you guys some new jewelry pieces that i just got because i've been waiting for this package to come in the mail for like a few days now and i have been so excited i just opened everything up and i got all these pieces from majuri they have the most stunning jewelry pieces i love anything that's gold and dainty and just like really fine i just find that that looks so clean and classy and it's just my favorite so i got a few pieces i'm going to show you what i got and also have the name on the screen just because i don't remember exactly what it's called but if you guys are interested in the pieces that i got I will have the name so you can like find exactly what it is on the website and before we get into the haul I did want to mention that they are sponsoring this video and I'm so excited I've loved their brand forever even before I my youtube days I would always buy pieces from them like when I was in college and stuff and I would always just like look at their website They have the cutest cutest stuff and I love how timeless it is and it's such good quality and um, yeah, so thank you guys for sponsoring and I did want to mention that they have a sale going on right now from November 24th to the 29th. You can get 20% off of your whole entire order if you spend over $150. And everything that I got is 14 karat gold so you can wear it in the water, in the shower. Like I like to invest in real gold pieces because I don't like to take my jewelry off and I just like to have it on at all times. Like when I buy nice pieces, like that's what I wear. Um, constantly so it's worth the investment plus you get 20% off so this is the best time to take advantage of that and also if you're looking to get somebody in your family or like hint hint if you want any of these pieces tell your boyfriend that they're having a sale um, your friends anything like that so they have amazing pieces you can get your loved ones for gifts and yeah i'll have everything linked in the description all the information linked to the website and stuff like that so make sure you definitely take advantage of the sale it's their biggest sale of the year and this is what i got we're going to start with the rings my nails haven't been done yet and also i have my gross broken nail um so if you see it i'm sorry so i got three rings and i wanted to create a stack that's something else i love about the jewelry is that it looks so good stacked i like i'm obsessed with doing ear stacks and like necklaces rings bracelets i go rings rings bracelets so i got three different rings and this is the first one right here it just has all of these diamonds it's so stunning so i want to wear this one first and i got them for my middle finger and then this is the second it's a gold just like a little dome ring and then it has a little stripe of diamonds here we go super cute and then this is the second one and then the third one right here is a flat ring with little diamonds again just they're all gold and they have the diamonds oh this looks so so good i'm obsessed and then i also got this bracelet right here which is so stunning it's very very fine just this little gold bracelet 
I love this. And then I got two little pairs of earrings, which I'll show you guys close up. But I have three holes in my ear. So my first hole, I usually just like am always changing out what hoops or earrings I'm wearing in my first hole. Just depends on what outfit I'm wearing. But my second and third hole, I never ever take out those earrings like I leave them in all the time no matter what earring I have in the first so I got new earrings for my second hole and then my third hole and they're so cute my third hole I got a little diamond and then my second hole I just have a little diamond hoop and I'm so obsessed with them they're so cute and just like dainty and make the perfect ear stack like I just I'm in love with the way that it looks. I've been so excited to get these pieces in the mail. So that is my little jewelry haul. And if you guys want to shop the Majuri sale, you definitely don't want to miss it. They have such an amazing deal going on right now. I'll have it linked down below in the description. And thank you guys so much again for sponsoring. And also, their sale is going on in their stores. I know that they have different locations across the U.S. Like they have a store in Boston that just opened in the Seaport. So for all my Boston girls watching, definitely go to the Seaport and pop in the store if you want to try on the pieces in person and pick them out there bring your boyfriend or your husband so he gets an idea of what you want <laughs> um, but thank you guys so much for sponsoring and I'll have everything linked down below I just got takeout from capo and I got a little salad I love this salad because it's like microgreens in tomato with vinaigrette it's literally my favorite and then I got a bolognese which is literally my favorite right now I've been so obsessed with it I've been craving it every single day I love it okay we're officially starting the packing process I have some things on my bed already and I'm really excited because I got some I need to set you guys up because I'm putting on some lip balm but I got some new things for the trip because I, it's my birthday, and I was like, you know what, I use the excuse every single time I would buy anything for like the two weeks leading up to my birthday. Well, I hadn't really bought anything like major in a while. I'll show you guys a few things that I got. A few of the clothing items, um, like this dress right here, I don't think I'm going to try on right now just because... I have my spray tan on still and I don't want to get anything like ruined but this is one of the dresses right here it's this really beautiful mesh dress you can't even tell like what it looks like because it like wraps around your neck um, but this is by Kim Shuey I don't even know if the colors are picking up on my camera because my room is yellow and also, if you live in the Boston area and you know like a good painting company, if anyone in your family is a painter, please comment down below and let me know because I just like need my room to be white because it really throws off my vibe when I'm filming. Like I'm not even gonna lie, the yellow just makes me look yellow, makes everything just look yellow and it's been too long and honestly like I know this might sound dramatic but like it makes me not even like want to ever film in my room just because of how bad the lighting is and then I like look up back at my old videos and all my room colors were like came up so perfectly on the camera and just made my videos look so crisp um but yeah it may not seem like a big deal but when this is like your job and you are filming your life 24 7 like it gets old real fast so if you have any good painters please let me know so that dress is super cute. Oh, I'm really excited about this bikini right here from Frankie's. It ties. Oh, this is the back. Wait, no, this is the back. And um, this is the front. So it just ties like this around your back. And yeah, that's what the bottom looks like. And then this is the top right here. It's blue and the material is really nice it's like i can't wait to wear this and i'm obsessed with the color and then i also got a set from frankie's as well which would be really cute for like morning breakfast like wearing over my bathing suit um while we get breakfast and like coffee and stuff like that i'm hoping that there's bikes where i'm staying so we can like bike somewhere 
but this is the top it's just a long sleeve cream top and i want to do like one button i think that would look really cute and then i also got the matching pants and again it's that same like ribbed material as the bikini that i got and oh i got another bathing suit i don't know if i'm gonna keep this one i still have to try it on um but i love the brand it's from revolve tropic of sea and this is what the bottoms look like they're like this almost like grayish brown and black zebra and the top looks like this i just don't know if i'm going to keep the top yet because i don't like this type of top on me i just feel like it's all tangled it looks like this but i just feel like i like more of like a triangle top it's more flattering for my body and then i got a bucket hat brown cute again it's like coming up such like it's such a weird color on the camera but really it's like not as bad as it's looking and my spray tan doesn't look this bad either trust me trust me trust me okay and then i also bought oh these are really cute i got a skirt which is hanging in my closet it's like a silk black skirt this is gonna be one of my outfits when i'm on the trip danielle guzio top looks like this and i'm gonna wear it with the black silk skirt and then i also got this dress but i'm not gonna wear it till i get back to boston it's like a knit turtleneck super cute with boots i'm really excited to wear this and then that's just a sweater um okay so that's everything that i got for clothes i'm pretty sure i got two pairs of sunglasses actually well i did get a pair of sneakers and a pair of ugg slippers um i did i did get a couple pairs of shoes but those are in my closet i'll show you once we get up but i want to show you the sunglasses because i got two new pairs i have like a sunglasses obsession and i'm really into them right now so this is the first pair they're by jack moose and this is what they look like they're like red mirrored on the front and then the like body of them is like a brown i'm obsessed i love the coloring in the mirror too like it's almost like orange and red and yellow depending on the way whatever way <laughs> the light hits so just got those and then i also got these from bottega which bottega just has like stunning stunning glasses i got these on revolve um and then the jack moose ones i got on forward and they look like this like i'm so obsessed with these so um anyway that's everything that i got i went real crazy <sighs> real crazy let me tell you but honestly it's just so easy shopping on revolve because they have so many different brands and you can just like add everything to your cart and buy it all at once and then it comes in two days and then if things don't work out if you don't like them if they don't fit like they literally give you a prepaid shipping label and you just put everything right back in the box that it came in stick it on and then drop it off at ups and like they refund you refund your card and it is w literally within like a day of shipping the stuff out so i just love that like i really think that that like seals the deal for me that's why i basically only shop on revolve um so yeah well i'm gonna start packing some outfits and putting some outfits together i'm gone saturday well we get there tomorrow night um 7 30 we land so we'll probably just do something chill saturday sunday is my actual birthday so i have did like daytime dinner daytime dinner monday daytime dinner tuesday leaving wednesday morning so i really need just like three outfits for daytime and three outfits for nighttime and then sleep workout plane and that's it. <laughs> My biggest piece of advice for traveling is to invest in good luggage. Like I bought these suitcases. I have two, I have a carry-on size and then also a large size. And I got these from away like three years ago. I remember I just had normal, like whatever luggage I just bought from TJ Maxx. Um, and I swear that it was the first year I started like traveling a ton and I went through like three different suitcases because the wheels were snapping off and then I was just like okay well I'm just gonna 
invest in some nice luggage and I bought the luggage from away and you can personalize it. I don't know if you guys can see, it has my initials right here. And I got the black and I love it. Like I've had it for so long and I've traveled so much over the past three years since I've had it and they're still in like perfect condition. So I highly recommend this brand. If you are looking to invest in some luggage, I always get questions about it. And the inside's really roomy too. There's like a whole side right here that has a mesh zipper that you can um, just put like shoes. I usually do shoes, toiletries, makeup, stuff like that on this side. And then on this side, there's like a little mesh thing right here that just clips. And then there's a pocket. So I'll usually put my clothes on the other side. And something that I actually swear by and I've been doing for years and years, like if you are an OG, sorry, I'm really struggling over here. If you are an OG to my channel, like you've been watching me forever, you will know how obsessed I am with my packing cubes. And you can get these from anywhere. They have them on Amazon. Um, I have the Cal Pack marble packing cubes back from when like marble was such like a popular thing. But I love them and again, these are in such good condition too. They're literally like brand new and I use them on every trip that I go on and it just makes it so easy to pack everything you need neatly in your suitcase. So I usually do like one packing cube for workout clothes and like sleep clothes. I usually do one that has like my bathing suits, one that has my daytime clothes, my nighttime clothes, and then there's a small one right here where you can put like underwear and socks and it fits everything. They just go neatly in your suitcase, clip it all together and then it's like you're so organized. And when you get to the hotel, like you know where everything is and it just makes it so neat. Your clothes don't get all messed up. So that's like my number one tip for traveling if you take anything away from this video. And I know I told you guys I wasn't gonna try on any of the clothes because of my spray tan, but here we are. I need to see what it looks like and also to pair it with my shoes and bag. So this is the Kim Shoey dress. It's super cute. It has this like detail on the side, um, little tie, which I obviously need to adjust, but you guys get the gist. So I did red pouch and then these heels are just green lace up from Femme Los Angeles. And this dress has so many different colors in it, like red, green, blue, white. So I decided to go with the red bag, green shoes, because red and green are complementary colors. So this is super cute. This could be an option for maybe my birthday night, dinner. <laughs> this outfit <laughs> was giving me absolutely nothing. And then I accessorized it put on some heels, and I did a red lip, and now I'm like really feeling it. So this is outfit, night outfit number two. And for details, we have Danielle Guzio top. The skirt is the one I was talking about from Revolve that I ordered. Shoes are my Bottegas. They have dupes for these literally everywhere. I know that they have some on Princess Polly and they also have some on Revolve. And for bag, I'm just doing a little black by far bag. Okay, I've actually decided that I think this is a vibe for the daytime. Like, during the day, I don't know. I'm just like vibing with the slides and the sunglasses because it doesn't definitely doesn't have to be a nighttime outfit and um, I feel like it'd be cute with like a bikini underneath as like my cover up because when you're on vacation like it really doesn't matter you know <laughs> so i think this is going to be like an option for cover up during the day okay this is another pool vibe um the jack moose sunglasses with the red bucket hat and then we have the brown to tie into the brown on the bikini and then i'm doing black set over it um, where's this shirt from? I think it's from ASOS and then pants are local European and then just going to do some slides. I think this is a vibe. Like I really like the sunglasses with the hat, like the red and the red. And then the earthy tones, like the brown, the black, 
the brown slides okay <laughs> those outfits literally are just me being extra and like having fun with fashion um but realistically this is like another outfit which is probably like what i would literally wear every day um if it wasn't my birthday weekend and i didn't want to be extra so little trucker hat this one's camo and green and then this royal blue bikini from frankie's the one with the two ties some denim shorts slides and then just a little over shirt and i want to wear the big bottega aviators and like a bunch of jewelry i feel like would look cool like layered necklaces and stuff like that i also wanted to bring a pair of jeans for nighttime because there's going to be one night sorry there's like fuzz all over my camera um there's going to be one night that it's going to be like in the 60s so i thought that i could wear jeans have on these little heels from bellini and then my jeans are from ally grace and my top is reformation okay we found a winner for night outfit number three um, I decided to go with this cute little crochet top from Reformation. It does come with a matching skirt, but since it's going to be chilly one night, I decided to go with the local European cargo pants. And then also the Bellini heels. Just little thong heels. And then Emma's Bottega bag, which I'm stealing from her closet. But I love the orange and green together. It's always like my go-to. So I think that this is going to be a cute little like nighttime outfit. Oh, and then the back of the top is all open, which I love. Okay, I also have this outfit that I could switch out with the black one for night. I just don't know if the black is the vibe. So we have brown boots, little brown skirt, and then this top from Orson Iris. And it just ties in the back and it's like a brown and blue zebra. When I watch the clips over, I'm gonna to try to edit this video a little bit tonight. I'm gonna to see which outfit looks better, but this is an option. Okay, I pretty much have everything I need. My night outfits, workout clothes, comfy outfit, and then these are day outfits. And then I have a pair of denim shorts I can wear like a tank top with, and then slides, um, bikinis, and I'm not really sure. If I need anything else, I feel like this is good. I'm just going to pack a few sleep sets. But other than that, I have all my bags, all the accessories, all my shoes. And I think we're good to go. I'm actually going to bring one more bag with me. I'm just going to bring one of these, um, like this type of bag right here. A little canvas tote for my beach bag. To like put my camera, my sunglasses, my wallet, like that type of stuff in it. Good morning, you guys. I slept so good. I'm so comfy. I love like just being able to lay in my bed after I wake up. Not have to do anything. Not have to go anywhere. Like it's Saturday. I am not hungover. I just like feel so fresh. Milo's also not here, so he's... I don't have to like get up to go walk him right away. He's on the cape right now with Emma. And yeah, I have a lot to do today though. My flight is at 3.50. I still have to get my nails done. I have to get um, my toes done. And I think that's it. I, I'm gonna finish packing a little bit, but I have like mostly everything done. My spray tan's looking good. <laughs> I'm so excited to go away, you guys. I just can't wait to be there. And like be in the sun and swim in the ocean. I'm literally so excited.
nails and toes are done. I got a really, really light pink gel. It was actually OPI Bubble Bath. And it just got something neutral because I feel like I haven't in a while. And then same on my toes. And I'll show you guys my airport outfit really quick. I'm wearing these silk like flowy pants that I got forever ago from Forever 21 and then my Skims cozy zip up. And then I have on this hat, just a little trucker hat <laughs> from Sun Life. And I'm wearing my Yeezy slides. And carry on is this canvas tote. I'm gonna bring my purse with me and we are good to go.